In this video, I show you everything that is new in our Edgewonk Trading Journal update for February 2023. First of all, let's switch to the dark mode. And the first thing that we changed is when you go to the calendar, you will right away get the current months and your detailed breakdown. So you see how many trades you have taken on that day and also the PL for that day. In the future, we will also add our multiple and percentage gain for the different days. You can directly also jump to that day. So by clicking on any given date calendar, then you will jump to the journal and the journal will show you the trades that have been closed on that day. Not taken, but closed. Now you can also reorder the columns in your journal. So you can just simply drag and drop them around in your journal. This is true for all the columns. So you can create a customized journaling experience. You can also reset the view by clicking on the icon here in the top right and then you get a default view. You can also manage your columns here. When we open the menu on the right, you can deactivate specific columns. You can also reactivate them. You can also reorder them by dragging and dropping them here in the menu. We now also implemented the ROI. So when we go to chart lab and then pull up the equity graph, and then when you change the display to percentage here, this is the ROI of your trading account. We're also going to add the ROI to other areas in your journal soon. Another thing that is new is that now the charts are clickable. So we can hover over any given graph or line chart. And by clicking, Edgewonk will show you the trade that is behind this data point. You can make changes right away here. And once you save it, it will also update in your journal. This is true for most of the graphs in Edgewonk now. We also fixed an issue in our exit analysis. Previously, we had some inconsistencies, but they have been completely fixed now. In the exit analysis, we are visualizing the price path. So for every trade, we show you how close has the trade come to your take profit, which is the green line at 100%. And also how close has the price come to your stop loss, which is the red horizontal line. The black marker visualizes where you exit the trade. We can also open the trades right away here and then take a deeper look into those trades. Some traders have asked about our milestones and you can bring them back into the home tab. Just go to the milestones and then by activating the selection here, the milestones will show up in your home tab on the right side. We made a separate video previously on the milestones, how they work and how they can help your trading. Check them out in our YouTube channel. To speed up your entry process for your trades, especially after importing your trades from your broker, we also made it easier now to change some parameters of your trades. For example, you can directly just click into the setup and then you can change the setups of any given trade here. This is also true for other things such as the trade comments. You can directly change them right away here or also your custom statistics. This will help you speed up your entry process significantly. You can also duplicate your journals. So by opening the journal overview, you can of course switch between the different journals. If you have more than one, you can create new ones or you can duplicate an existing one. With the latest update, we added some options here to make the duplicating process more efficient. We also update our FAQ. So when you go here to the top right at your account and then you go to documentation and help, you will find now the updated FAQ. You can type on any term that you want to know more about and then the FAQ will bring it up. You can also navigate around the FAQ by using our broader categories. I wish you a lot of fun with the new update. If you have any feedback, let us know in the comments. Happy journaling.